well toward the door. Now what I think we purchased, Fable asked. A cool tone in her voice. Bunny stopped in her tracks and spun around. Turnips, cabbage, beanstalk, roots. Fable raised a single eyebrow. I think dark magic is delicious. Bunny's eyes widened. Her gaze darted to the wall, to the painting of the thorn family crest. In the corner, in the center of the crest, the nerf toed doors of dark magic. Hmm. What is it? Modern doors. Of dark magic. Wrapped around the evil wolf eye that seemed to follow Bunny no matter where she stood in the room. The painting was. Initiating to some and responsible to others depending on what side of the magical world once. One stood. You can, you can't see dark magic. Bunny said, though she didn't sound e entirely convinced. A dark fairy can do whatever she sees with dark magic. Little cool informed her. Bunny's nose twist and thrill. Fatal to see that her little dark magic. Had startled, stirred, stirred, uncertain, uncertainty, 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 and her roommate. Of course, Fatal would never use dark magic to hurt Bunny or any other student at Ever After High, causing harm to others could get her expelled. While well, at school, it, it, it was best to follow her headmaster's rule, or at the very least, appear mm -hmm. to be doing so. But every once in a while, a reminder was needed. Abel was no ordinary student at, at that fact should be forgotten. Forgotten not. Oh. I can never be forgotten not by her roommate. Not by her roommate. Not by anyone. Fabel's mother was the dark fairy, the one who hadn't been invited to the celebration after Sleeping Beauty was born. And thus, thus had cursed Sleeping Beauty to sleep. For 100 years, the dark fairy was royalty in the fairy world, and it was Abel's destiny to one day wear her mother's crown and become the most villainous of the fair of all fairies. It was Abel's opinion to a, a glorious destiny to a destiny, and it filled her with pride. So as she looked at her Wonderland roommate, she smiled most wickedly. And the future, I suggest you keep your veggie snacks on your side of the room. Her eyes blazed, and both threads rose off the floor. Just a little reminder. Of her magical powers. Sure, okay, Bunny. Go. Oh. You're sure. Yeah. You're you're right. I've been kind of messy. Oh dear. Is that a correct time? I'm going to be late for a very important date, and up off she went as quickly as she could. Who? Who could blame her for wanting to make her escape?